Hey, what is going on guys? Rulinel here, coming back at you with more Python, and we're looking at the zip file module. Alright, in the last video, it was really, really easy. All we did was just create a zip file. We called ours shopping.zip, and now in this video, we're actually going to fill it with stuff. So, I'm going to create a, a few ramble damble cool things. I'm actually just going to create a list, and these are going to be our items. And let's say... Um, eggs, cats, mm, Tonka trucks, <laughs> um, people, <laughs> and uh, let's let's have fun with this. What else? What else do we want in here, guys? Let's have babies. <laughs> And uh, I, we gotta do something else. We gotta do something else. Virgins and uh, pumpkins. You know. <laughs> okay. So whatever. There's our list of, of of stuff. So what we're gonna do now that we've created those items is um, we're actually going to add a bunch of file names uh, of those things into our zip file, and we're going to actually. Um, fill those up with with things <laughs> fill those files with with some content so actually let's go ahead and create all of these objects so for item in items let's say that um object name is going to equal item plus like a dot text and let's say object name can be actually we want to write to that because we just object handle actually we want to create a file we want to create a file descriptor and we're going to open up the object name that we just created because we know that's going to be the file name that we want to work with we're going to open it up to write let's go ahead and write to it object handle write I need to buy some, and then we can add on items. Item, actually, we want the current one that we're working with. And uh, object handle dot close. Okay, so that will create all of the objects that we need. Actually, let's just say this can be upper the uh, a capital uppercase version of what we're doing. So those are all of our items. Alright. So now that those have all been created, what we're going to actually do... Actually run this and see if we get them to be created. I'll open up my uh, terminal here. Now we have babies, eggs, people, pumpkins, Tonka trucks, and virgins. All the stuff that we need for a fully functioning community, you know? And uh, I need to buy some eggs. Awesome. I need to buy some... Uh, I need to buy some virgins. <laughs> All right, cool. So we got everything that we need practically. Let's uh, let's go ahead and add these to our zip file, our zip archive. Now you guys know the way we can do this. I'm actually going to have it in inside of our loop here. We can go ahead and say zip archive. We can write to it, and we're going to want to pass in the file name of what we're actually adding. So. And we've set that up to be the object name. And then we close our zip file like we already have here. And we're practically done. Let's go ahead and run this. Alright, now if I look over here. If I open up my uh, shopping zip file. We've got virgins, tonka trunks, pumpkins, people, everything. And if I extract one of these files, it says, I need to buy some pumpkins. And you can see that this is, um, if I save this, this is in my temporary folder. So, because we just quickly clicked on it, uh, we can't, we, that's, that's freaking all we've got here, guys. <laughs> there is, uh, very quickly adding things to our shopping zip archive. All it takes is one function called write, and that's what we need to do. Cool. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this, and I will talk to you in the next tutorial. Bam!